I know, I know, it's been a long time, but welcome back, guys. I'm just trying to, I'll just try to catch you up on what happened. So, school ended, obviously. Uh, went on vacation for like a month and a half. My birthday passed. Started a new gaming channel, go check that out. Links in the description. Uh, school started again. And, uh, yeah, now I'm starting middle school, so. Yeah, I'm going to get some room in to post, but if you actually looked a few months ago, maybe like two or three, uh, I actually did post a video over there, so I had to delete it. So, yeah, we didn't have to, but I just chose to. So, yeah, so welcome back to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. I haven't done this in a while, I'm just going this right now. So, so. Today, we th it's going to be the first lesson of the trombone, which I actually just started playing, so I'm not a champion yet, but uh, yeah, I hope you like this video, don't forget to subscribe like I just mentioned, turn the bell icon so you don't miss the video, send it, uh, put it to all, not just personalized, and yeah. So, the first lesson on the trombone, obviously how to assemble it. So, there's obviously these latches, and then this tab, which, I, which is the company I got my trombone from. Some will have two, some will have three, minus two. So I just undo those latches, and you open it. Here's what should be in a trombone space. And don't expect this to be in, I just got it. So, yeah. I hope this is good enough. Let's see. Okay, there we go. You see, there's my ribbons and all that stuff. Uh, so, yeah. We have to assemble it first. So, you get your slider out. This is a slider. It should not slide right now. Because it should have a lock on it. Mine, my lock is jammed. This is the first time I'm using this, so my slider is free, which is not very good. But yeah, I'll teach you how to undo that lock in a little bit. And then obviously the bell with the bell is the main part of the instrument. And then get an instrument without a mouthpiece. Here's a mouthpiece. You would notice that there is this grease cream and then this oil I'll teach you that in another lesson just leave that for now so yeah and then you obviously have the mouthpiece so yeah and then again like I showed you you can just get this off Amazon or something I don't know what it is I don't know what it's for it's not mandatory but you can just get it now we can move that out of the way how to assemble it. So, the way you're going to assemble it, actually, what? I'm going to move you guys. Right back. So, back to this position. Okay. So, you should have, like I said, the two pieces. I'm going to put my bed. Mine is pretty greasy right now. Just don't mind that. It's very good. And the mouthpiece and this little rag. It should have an opening at one side actually, which I forgot to tell you. So yeah, now the assembly. So these are the only three mandatory parts, the mouthpiece, uh, the bell, and the uh, slider. The oil and the grease is also very important. <laughs> so yeah, make sure you have that or else stuff can happen, which I don't know because it never happened to me yet. Actually, you can see my head a little bit. Alright, so you're gonna. So this is for right-handed righties. So if you lefty, check out another video. So what you're gonna do? You're gonna hold this with your right hand, and then hold this. Oh, okay. Hold the slider with your left hand, 
and place it facing the oh sorry the bell on your left hand and the sleigh on your right hand. I'm very confused with my left and right right now, so don't mind me. So this long part should be facing towards your left, and the bell should also be facing towards the left. So you can just hold it like this, and then you're gonna put the opening into this long stick and it should just fit and then what you're going to do next is you're going to push this push the slider so it rotates away from you so then if you look at it from this angle which is your angle right now this section should cover the back of the slide <clears throat> and then you know it's going to come out so right above there, this is the rotating kind of thing. You're just going to push it towards the left all the way until you can't move anymore. That is the screw. So, yeah. So I got your trombone. Then the mouthpiece is fairly easy. You just put it in this hole right here. It should make that sound. Then it's good. So, in the last part, which I actually forgot to do, we're going to take off this bill again. Again, if you don't have this, then you can keep this screwed. Okay, so this, what I was talking about, this kind of bonnet thing, it just goes around the bell. It kind of looks cool, so I doubt it would be for looks. Maybe it's a tone it down a little, possibly. So now it kind of looks like this with this pretty cool rag thing around it. I know this is not an edit. Seriously, it's not an edit. I promise you this is not an edit. Um, and I can't even edit, so yeah. So yeah, you can, once you do that, that's just an easier way to put it in. And one thing you should do that I forgot to know. The slider is the most <coughs> sorry. This slider is the most fragile part of the instrument. So if it falls like this, so it lands on the bell before the instrument, then it should land and stay intact. But only if you don't like drop it from like this height or something. And then it drops. Then no. And in case you know what, uh, what I'm talking about, this is my leg. My foot is barely touching the ground, so. Yeah, and then to undo the lock, so from this angle with uh, the mouthpiece facing away from you, and if you feel like this is rotating way too easily, so it should rotate at any moment, try screwing the screw in. Also, Eating right before playing sounds a little dumb, but it actually sometimes a little helps with your blowing, which I'm going to teach you how to blow in the next lesson, which is probably going to be posted today anyway. I might, I might just squeeze into this lesson. So, yeah. This is the trombone. Completely finished assembling and yes it is one of the longest instruments in the brass instrument family and I just chose to play because I want to play so before I teach you how to unlock the slide I am going to teach you how to hold the instrument because most beginners who've never handled an instrument like a trombone their first re reflex is just to hold it like this and start sliding it's definitely not how it works. So, again, this is for righties. And if you're lefty, you just do this with the left hand. So, the bell facing the left. Yes, it's left. Your right hand, I mean your left hand too, I'm so confused. Go on this bell brace down here. I don't actually know how to it like this so you can see. Because all of these are going to be important in this. So you put your thumb right here. 
Actually, I'm gonna show this a little closer. So your thumb goes on this shorter bell brace. There's the tuning slide. This right here, which is connected to these two bell braces. This should be one of the lowest brace that's connected to the bell. Your index finger goes to the stem of the mouthpiece. And then all the other fingers go under this. Go under this first slide brace. And then with your right hand, you need to get your two index fingers. Put your index and your middle finger. What? There's only one index finger. And then you put your thumb right above them on this lower bell brace. And then your pinky and your ring finger can just be tucked in into your palm. Or you can just like stick them like that, or you can just tuck them in. And that is how you hold the trombone. Unlocking the slide. So right here, right under the stem on the second bow brace, this right here would be hooked onto this. And mine is jammed, so I'm gonna have to go fix it tomorrow. So you just simply move that, and then your slide's gonna be free. So yeah, that is the first lesson on the trombone. And then the next lesson, I am going to show you how to, like, you know, first five notes, how to blow into your instrument, because that is actually very important, and then the seven positions, because I know it's just random, like, go on. It's not like random, like, 360 or something, no. There's specific notes that there are in the trouble. So, very quickly, I'm going to show you the disassembly, and that's going to wrap up the video. So, you know, let's put this down somewhere. Don't drop it like I should have said. And dropping it is gonna be really bad. Hey, you get your case. Well, this from this angle. Can't see my face, but whatever. Unlatch. Open the instrument. So, disassemble. First, take out your mouthpiece. Just, it'll just come out. Sometimes you're gonna have to like unscrew it. You can unscrew the part that holds the slider in the belt. Make sure you lock your slider too. And then you rotate it like this, and then it's gonna come out. Put it in. Like so. Take out the rack, or you can keep it on. I'm just gonna take it out. Put it in there. And then stick the bell in. Close it up. Close the latches. And that is the first lesson on the trombone. So, thank you very much for watching this video. If you like it and if it's useful to you, make sure you uh, subscribe to this channel, like the video, subscribe to the channel anyway if you don't like it. Uh, and I'll see you for the next lesson, which is probably going to be posted today as well. Peace. See you later.